This is a very interesting import that Bibliophiles brought in from the USA. It's called So Bravely and So Well. It's a very large, this is called landscape format, and it's the life and art of William T. Trigo. Well, William Brock Trigo was born in September 1856 to a prolific and much sought after artist, Jonathan Trigo. Here is his father and his wife, Emily. She, he was the fifth of six children. But at the age of 18 months, the poor little thing became severely ill with portfolio and... Uh, with, with, with portfolio? No, no, not at all. With polio. And that left him severely paralysed with his hands bent out of shape and scarcely able to walk. So how could he possibly produce artwork in the future like this? And here's the most splendid gatefolded page in full colour in this very, very glamorous tribute to him. It's, um, it explains to us that he, that he studied at the Pennsylvania Academy of Fine Arts and at the Academy Julian in Paris. And although he never had the first-hand horror of war, he lived through the American Civil War and the Franco-Prussian Wars, and this is much of what he depicts and what, what inspired him. And there's some very detailed close-up here with some of the models' faces, countless charcoal sketches working up to the men and horses on the final canvas. And you see every straining sinew of the horses' bodies, and anatomically, it's very, very correct indeed. Different scenes of war, but also at the towards the end of his life these stunning portraits farmer and his wife winter farmer and his dog and the colors and the rural pastoral scenes wife husband and wife dancing and playing fiddle by the fireside and this lady of shallot are utterly dreamy almost photographic some of them 100 color and black plates. It's a $39.95 book, so bravely and so well from bibliophilebooks.com. It's only £12.